All right, so uh, we're on the road again. I actually almost did this uh, challenge earlier in the week. Um, packed up all the gear into the, the car and everything, and then I realized, can you stay like in the appropriate lane? Don't want to die or anything. Then I realized that um, this challenge actually contains alcohol, booze, hooch, grog, whatever you want to call it, and uh, quite a substantial amount. So I thought, you know, I can't really be uh, driving home after a food challenge partially drunk, inebriated, intoxicated. I'm not a Premier League footballer, probably not gonna get away with it. So um, yeah, I thought I'd wait for, uh, for my wingman here. So that's what we're doing today. About what, like an hour away? Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> to uh, order the food now. It's, it's clearly, it's gonna be a good day. Look, I, that was the first time. Um, <laughs> was it though? Was it was. was you tell these people that it, was, like, it took like two, three takes. Two, three. First time. First time. Five. Alright, so um, today we're at the uh, Rising Sun in uh, Bredbury. Oh, I almost got it first time. And we're taking on their, uh, their burger challenge. Does it have a special name or just burger challenge? Bodacious burger challenge. Dude, <laughs> bodacious burger challenge. Nobody's finished it, right? How's it yet? No? And uh, you get 15 minutes to finish? That's correct. And uh, it does include this ginormous Stein. Stein. Ready, wherever you are, yeah. Wherever you are. Three, two, one, go! Alright, let's get stuck in. No messing about today, Adam, please. <laughs> I'll take it. What's up, Bidabi? Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. And uh, here we go. Another episode of The Chronicles of Bid, the series where I uh, travel to restaurants with food challenges and just impress some local strangers by cramming lots of food in my throat. They have to wash that beard afterwards. <laughs> they will. <laughs> Not right away though. That's one of the bonuses of having a beard. You get to enjoy the aroma of a meal for hours later. Is it hot? <laughs> we'll put the steam coming up. I was going to say, it's hot. Yeah, piping hot. But yeah, that came in handy because these things were thick. No way, I bet you hot. I can't start it. Do you want to do it? Instead of I'm not a big beer drinker these days, but... Ah, uh, yeah. Sadly, gone are the days of getting all liquored up and dancing around shirtless to Kesha. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Or am I? <laughs> no, I'm actually kidding. Anyway, uh, today we're at the Rising Sun in Bredbury taking on their bodacious burger challenge. Like I said in the intro, I don't really know why I repeated that. I've got to say the burger was... The burger was delicious. Yeah, the burger was freaking yummy. And I, I know what you're thinking. This is a bit of a randy size challenge, right? <laughs> but we don't discriminate over here, you know. Challenges big and small, they all need to be conquered. It's kind of like uh, Pokemon, right? Got to catch them all, whether it's a Squirtle or one of the big ones, I don't know. <laughs> I'm too old for Pokemon, I'm not into that kind of thing. But you get the idea. It's not the biggest thing I've ever eaten by any stretch of the imagination, but it was still a lot of fun to film and uh, beer, right? Bonus. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, but the uh, this kind lady over here, she's um, filming this for Facebook, so I don't want to be a total mess. Yeah, that boat has sailed, Sonny Jim. Anyway, let's get, um, let's get professional for a few seconds. A few words on the challenge. It's reasonably new, uh, but it has been attempted a few times by these fine uh, gentlemen here. Uh, it consists of a a rather large burger, some fries, coleslaw, and of course this stein. <laughs> She's a ball buster. <laughs> yeah, look at Mrs. Big going mad with power again. Anyway, yeah, if you uh, if you finish it inside 15 minutes, you don't get a free t-shirt or anything cool like that, but you do win the meal free, which is pretty key. I think it's 15 quid to attempt. 
And uh, yeah, you do have to finish the, the Stein of Beer, uh, which is pretty key. I think that's why most people will fail this. Are you enjoying your nachos, darling? Yeah, I'm doing <laughs> Mrs. Beer thinks she's refereeing the, the FA Cup final here or something. All those Instagram followers would go into her head. <laughs> I dropped a chip in the coleslaw. <laughs> Chips and coleslaw? That's, uh, that's like a, a demonic cocktail of foods if ever I've heard of one. <laughs> anyway, um... I've got to say that the burger here was delicious. You know, the, the, the coleslaw on there, but the, the burger was absolutely fantastic. So I would highly recommend this. 15 quid's very reasonable for what you get here. And uh, on the house, if you can do it in 15 minutes, which is very doable. We've still got a room there, yeah. Oh, we've still got yes. a sign to drain room. Yeah, yeah. 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 it's got loads of... You know, you, you run it halfway. <laughs> halfway. Eight minutes out of the 15. Easy like a Sunday morning. Yeah. <laughs> Going. Yeah, easy there, Lionel Richie. You still got to finish the thing. We did film this on a, a Sunday though, which is probably why I said that. Well, <laughs> it's a little bit of cheese. Is that all right, darling? Is that okay? Bottoms up. What beer is this? Carlin. <laughs> Carlin. I feel very British right now. <laughs> yeah, I know what you're thinking. The Carlin was not my choice. Um, it, it's kind of like to beer what McDonald's is to burgers. But um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you at the next one. Nine minutes and 47 seconds. That's remarkable. Oh, thank you very much. Well done. <coughs> is there, um, I do need to burp. I'm not going to do it in public. I don't suppose you have a dessert menu, do you? That's right, baby. Is that the first time I've done a food challenge with beer involved? Uh, Sure. Can you just put that around the stein handle so no one has to touch it? Yes, as soon as I wipe my beard down. I'm assuming the reason most people haven't done that is the, the beer. The beer, okay. yeah. They should do this with like uh, a stein full of pina colada. I'd, I'd be totally on board for that. <laughs>